A strong core will help with both posture and breathing. So if you are someone who gets short of breath kind of easily, it's important that you work out your core. So your abdominal muscles need to be worked out in order to help you breathe better. So um, I'm gonna go through a series of ab exercises that you can do while you're sitting in a chair. And um, the big thing with these is that you want to make sure that you're breathing correctly while you do the exercise, because if you don't breathe correctly during the exercises, you're not gonna get the full benefit, okay? So when I say breathe correctly, I mean you want to breathe in slowly through your nose, filling up your lungs, and then you want to exhale through pursed lips. So inhale through your nose and exhale through pursed lips. So while you're doing that, you also want to make sure that you're breathing from your belly or um, your diaphragm. So you can use those words interchangeably there, but your diaphragm is a muscle that sits right under your lungs kind of like this where my hands are. When you breathe in through your nose, your diaphragm should come down and your stomach out to allow room for you to get air into your lungs. Then when you breathe out, your diaphragm will go back up and your stomach will go in. So for a lot of people, this is opposite of what you've gotten used to doing. So this is really important you wanna make sure that your stomach is going in and out at the right time. So first, we're gonna practice that. To practice, you can do it two different ways. You can put one hand on your chest and one hand on your stomach. When you breathe in through your nose, you want the hand on your stomach to move outward and inward as you exhale. The hand up here should not be moving, okay? So you wanna breathe in through your nose, Pushing that stomach out and then exhale through pursed lips. Inhale and exhale. Another way to check this is hands on your stomach, pointer fingers touching each other right over your belly button. You wanna inhale through your nose. These fingers should come apart. And then exhale, they will go back together. So whatever way is easiest for you, you want to do that. So um, I always like this one. I don't know why, but I'm going to put my hands here. We're going to do five nice, big, deep breaths in order to engage your stomach muscles so that um, your body is preparing for the exercises. Okay. So inhale through your nose and exhale. One more. Awesome. Now, you want to make sure you're sitting up nice and tall. Put your hands behind your head. This is going to be an upright sit-up. So you want to breathe in through your nose, pushing your stomach out. And then you're going to exhale as you fold forward. And then inhale, pushing your stomach out as you come back up. This one is very important that you breathe correctly, okay? So in through your nose, we're gonna do five of these. In through your nose, exhale down. Inhale as you come up. Exhale back down. Inhale. And exhale. Inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down one last time, and inhale as you come up. Now you can drop your arms, kind of shake your upper body out just a little bit. Your stomach is definitely engaged after that. Now we're going to do a little twist. 
So you're gonna inhale through your nose. Exhale as you look over your right shoulder. And then inhale as you come back. Exhale over to the other shoulder. Inhale on the way back. We're gonna continue this. Inhale. This is a nice gentle stretch because it's very important as you do these you're focusing on the strength of your stomach. Exhale as well as the stretching because if you hold a lot of tension in your upper body, it's going to be harder for your lungs to expand the way they should. Exhale. Inhale. And exhale. We're gonna do one more on each side. Inhale, exhale. Inhale back to center and exhale. And then inhale back to center. Very good. All right, the next one I call open and close. Simply opening and closing your arms. So you wanna hold your arms out in front of you, palms together. Inhale as you open up to a T, and then exhale, you bring those hands back together. Inhale, and exhale. Inhale, open, and exhale, close. One more big deep breath in through your nose. And exhale. Perfect. Now the next one's going to be another nice stretch for your back and your upper body. I'm gonna turn sideways so you can see this better. In yoga, this is called a cat cow. So you're going to inhale as you look up and then you're gonna exhale as you round your back. So you want to inhale and exhale, inhale up, and exhale, inhale, two more, one more. Now we're going to turn to center. I love that one because I always hold a lot of tension in my upper back and that one is just perfect for me. So um, one of my favorites. Okay, so the next one that you're going to do, you're going to lean back just a little in your chair. So I'm gonna show you from the side again because you'll sit up nice and tall, put your arms out in front of you and just kind of lean back. Okay, now that you're like this, arms behind your head and you're just going to gently pulse up 10 breaths or not breaths but 10 times while you're taking a breath so while you're like this go ahead and inhale through your nose and then you're going to pulse up now you can sit up nice and tall that one's kind of hard to do so you wanna take a nice big deep breath and let it out. Now your next one's going to be very similar. You're going to lean arms out in front and then lean back again. Inhale, and this time you're gonna exhale as you pull one arm back and turn to the side. Inhale back up and exhale. Very good. 
Good, sit back up. Take another nice big deep breath while you sit up nice and tall. And we're gonna do the right hand. So I'm gonna turn forward again so you can see what I'm doing, but arms out in front. Now lean back, inhale through your nose, and exhale to the side. One more. Sit up nice and tall. There you have it. That's 10 minutes of gentle ab exercises as well as stretching that are going to help your breathing throughout the day. Thank you.